What a great video we just saw. What do you think, Elena? I agree with you, Frank. I think that was a really great video. Very, very inspiring to see what all of our officers are doing. Yeah, we're really sorry that we couldn't do that in person and do our actual torch runs like we have in the past. But we really wanted to show our support for the athletes of Special Olympics Maryland. And so I really appreciate the team effort from across the state, all those agencies represented. And I just love the do-it-yourself torches that the athletes presented. Wasn't that great? That was very great. I think a lot of our athletes out there are very creative with coming up with their own torches with what they got at home. So what my, some people might know is that the torch that we carry is called the Flame of Hope, and it has meaning. So, Elena, what does that mean to you? The Flame of Hope to me means it's the guiding light for all of us athletes, and it's a light that will never be extinguished. Well, we only may see it burning at the Flame of, the flame of Hope burning at our summer games, that after the summer games conclude, it's a flame that will live on in here forever. Oh, that's great. Well, you know, as a guardian of the flame, we promised that that spark that started with Chief Lemonian you know, all the way back when in uh, Kansas, that as law enforcement officers participate in the law enforcement torch run for Special Olympics, we promise to keep that flame and that beacon of hope bright and shining for you. So it, it's a wonderful thing. I, I can't state enough how much I appreciate all the athletes participating in the virtual torch run with us this year. And Elena, do you have anything else you want to say to the, your fellow athletes and the law enforcement officers out there? I just want to say, I know the, this is the times we are in, we're not expected, but don't worry, we will be together again one day. And also a very happy 50th anniversary to Special Olympics Maryland. Here's to another 50 golden years. I couldn't say it better. And in the torch run, we have that one saying, just one more. So if you've never participated in a law enforcement torch run, or if you're a police officer who wants to get involved, please make contact with us or find an athlete and they'll put you in touch with us. So I think we have Adam coming up next talking about uh, fitness. So Adam Hayes, take it away. <laughs> 